Hey guys, Brian Beeler coming to you from the Storage View Lab. Today we've got something a little bit different that falls outside of our typical scope, but every now and then we work with a vendor or brand that has something that piques our curiosity and Kevin says, I need to play with those things. And so that's what we did here with A10. Now they've got um, a really interesting set of KVM over IP extenders. And we've got three different sets here. And in fact, while, uh, while we're talking, I'm gonna go ahead and power these on and let them do their thing. They um, basically will power on and make a couple bleepy bloopy noises and we'll be off and running. In the case of the one here in the back, what we've got going on is the Lenovo Think Center IoT PC plugged in and passing uh, video and USB controls over this transmitter and it's coming all the way over here to this receiver that's connected to the display. Now, traditionally you would have a separation of more than four feet between these things, but if you can imagine having uh, PCs in a, in a data center or a central location powering smart displays, uh, conference centers, all sorts of things that could be used uh, to transmit those video images across long distances. So if we think about a traditional connection between a computer and a monitor being a few meters, if we look at uh, a display port cord or, or something of that sort, this lets you use IP or some optical connections depending on the boxes uh, to do that, those extensions. Now we do have three different sets here and they're all a little bit different. This set that, that I'm demoing here is a PoE set. Um, this guy is uh, another one that has uh, HDMI and uh, some additional connectivity on the back to give you more flexibility. And then we've got this uh, slim set of receiver transmitter marked by the R and the T um, that again has an, another set of, uh, of connectivity just depending on the needs. So while I've been talking, this guy has popped up and you can see that uh, on the receiver here, we've got the, the keyboard and mouse plugged in. We've got the uh, monitor that's local to me, you know, assuming that this is off somewhere uh, tens or hundreds of meters away, potentially. And I'm able, able to control this and, and manage the display as I like. Now, the other neat thing that A10 has is they've got a whole application for managing an environment that would have dozens of these things in it. So if you think about a conference center, uh, certainly not our use case, but a use case where they spend uh, a lot of time and have tremendous success, they've got an application that'll let you transition between which receivers uh, are, are blasting uh, or receiving from which transmitters that are blasting out the, uh, the signal and the controls. Uh, we've also been able to play with these a little bit in some of our video recording use cases. So where we're in a room or in a confined space, uh, we can use a set of these guys to pipe out to uh, an auxiliary display outside of the room for control board uh, usage and, and things of that nature, which is just another way to separate the recording area, keep it quiet and, uh, and secure, and then push out the uh, the display and controls to uh, to an external room. Again, just going over IP, like in the case of this one that can be done over PoE or the others that have uh, dedicated power supplies. So overall, they're really neat little units. It's fun to mess around with new technology that pushes, pushes us outside of our, our normal envelope. And uh, a company like A10 that, that uh, is new to us and many of you I'm sure is new to as well, that just has these really great solutions for a very specific use case. But if you're in that world, these things are great. Um, so we're looking forward, we're gonna hang on to, to a set of these guys. We're looking forward to continuing to find new ways to leverage them in the lab. Kevin's got some additional thoughts already about how we can uh, push all sorts of fun stuff over IP. He's always excited about these things. So we'll get back to that. But for now, A10 is the company and these things are, uh, are pretty neat little KVM over IP extenders.